Well, let's check in now with ENCA's uh, Slindelo Masikane, who is in Germiston for us this morning. Slindelo, good morning to you. Where exactly are you and what are you seeing? Good morning. Yes, I am at the Germiston taxi rank. Now, this is where the march uh, is supposed to actually take place, where the uh, Taxi Association, Santaco, and its members are set to march to the council offices. Now, I'm just going to move out of shot just to show you what I'm seeing and uh, let Jewel just pan and show our viewers exactly what's happening here. If you can see, uh, taxis are definitely at a standstill. They're not moving. Um, we have uh, commuters who are waiting in line, kind of um, anticipating whether the taxis will start moving or not. Some people have actually started loading up. It looks like some uh, taxis are planning on uh, taking commuters uh, to work this morning. However, majority of the, the taxis are at a standstill. Um, commuters are basically just patiently waiting to see if anybody will actually uh, take them uh, to their places of work. So as you can see, um, uh, um, some movement, but not very much. Uh, Celine, can you give us some idea as to what has uh, sort of sparked the strike? What is the actual reason? We know that it's about the bus rapid transport system. What are taxi? Uh, what are those in the taxi industry saying about this? Why are they unhappy about this? We've heard a number of reasons, you know. Uh, we've been told that uh, the taxi industry is not happy about the integration and the implementation of the BRT system. Now, that's the um, the buses uh, that transport um, commuters here in Egruleni, which are um, from, the, from uh, the, the municipality. So they're saying that they're not happy with uh, the integration. We've also heard that they are calling for Mzwandile Masina, which is the mayor of Egruleni, to step down or to resign because they're also not happy with his leadership. Um, we've also heard that uh, the taxi industry is not happy with the maintenance of the roads in Ekuruleni. We're told that um, uh, the, 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 the roads are, are, are damaging their cars, they're, they haven't been maintained, you know, the potholes are, are causing some serious damages to their cars. And then we've also heard um, that uh, there's been an incident in Tembisa where there's been rock throwing as well there and uh, that the, the, the taxi uh, drivers and taxi owners there are striking because um, of the prices of the, the, the quantums that they use. Um, so we, we're, we're hearing a number of reasons. All right, so officially, though, I mean, the, the march that is planned for today, we know that Santaku giving the city notice that they will be embarking on a march today. Do we know what officially has been their reason, what is their stance, and why they're they planning this march? And also, have there been threats of violence in, in, in the uh, lead-up to today's strike? Officially from Santaco and the leadership, the main reason for the march is because of the implementation and, and integration of the BRT system. So that, that is the official reason that we know for this march and that they want um, Zwandi Lemasina to, to step down. Um, what we also know uh, is that uh, bus services as well will be affected. Uh, communication from the municipality, uh, from the, the, the city of Ekurleni, um, Rather has stated that the, the bus service system will not be operating today. So commuters will seemingly really have to find their own means of transport today as taxis are affected as well as bus services. All right, we'll continue to keep an eye on that situation. Thank you very much, ENCA Silindelo Masikane at a taxi rank there in Germiston for us this morning.